In this video, I'm going to show one of many ways that you can take a sweep feature and trim it back to a particular surface. This is not the only method or the only way of doing this, but I've, I wanted to show real fast one of the ways you can do this. If we uh, look at our sweep here in our model tree, let's go ahead and edit definition. At this point, you can see our trajectory and the start and end points. If you right click on this node, you can tell it to trim at this surface here and that trims your sweep so that it stops or terminates at that surface so let's go ahead and hit OK and one thing you can do real quick is when you pick this extrude in this example I'm going to say control C control V or uh, copy and paste and then hit OK and I just created a surface there Okay, then I can take this trajectory, I'm going to pick the actual surface there, and then up here in the, in the UI you see the offset feature. The offset feature obviously has uh, four different methods. One of them down here is called replace, replace surface. So what you can do is simply pick this quilt that we just did, and it will actually fill the rest of that trajectory in for you so really it's just adding a couple of features to allow this this sweep to terminate at this surface again this is just one of many ways you can accomplish this just wanted to share that I hope you enjoyed it